Hey guys, Florida Man Mason here. Got this new project here. 1999 Geo Metro. And this is going to be the new project for the channel for a while. But wait a minute, I got something else to show you guys. about two Geo Metros. So I guess we'll start with the start of the show. This is Tic Tac, a 1999 Geo Metro. I don't care if it's marketed as a Chevy Metro. Actually, it's, it's actually a Suzuki Swift, okay? So, anyhow, who cares? This is my 1999 Geo Metro. I paid 800 bucks for her. She's in pretty okay shape. I've done work to her. Um, like, my hood and my bumpers. I painted those black. Um, we actually took this on a road trip to Georgia. Um, never actually showed, I actually never uploaded that video. Um, maybe I will, I'll probably post some clips. Are you fucking kidding me? All right, now that I'm not being interrupted by fucking helicopters. So, like I said, I've done some work to this thing off camera. I have replaced the cam and crank seals, the timing belt, uh, Here's some clips on the screen for you. We're doing cam seals on the Metro. I've so far pulled off the rubber tubing that goes there. Look at how much oil there is. It's caked everywhere. Look at the alternator. I get to work in that sweet, uh, I guess, updates in a bit. I don't know. Problem is that eight through the, I'll, I'll post a video of that running, but that's the, the timing belt right there that's not good anyhow as you can see it's very much leaking oil that's a lot of oil huh <sighs> looks like i'm gonna have to get a lot of degreaser also holy fuck the fan makes this so much nicer oh got the seals replaced as you can see nice and new now i'm getting it back in time that's been a pain in the ass now you're done with those clips um now you cop to what the work i've done to this thing yeah i said i like i said i painted it um, it's got decently low miles on it. It has a hundred or actually yeah, 128,000 as of this filming. Um, she has some rust holes we need to fix. Obviously the interior is not perfect by any means on this car. Well, that's a cool shift knob, I guess. I guess I'll show you under the hood. Under the hood, we have a 1.0 three cylinder. If you're familiar with Geo Metros, you know all about these. Also, the previous owner put a lawnmower battery on it. Why? I have no idea, but he just did. Um, new plugs, new wires, all that. Obviously, I replaced the timing belt. Uh, new serpentine belt, which I need to tighten. Which I need to tighten. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. So, yeah. Lots of new parts done to it. Just needs to do the CV axles for this one. And interior brings us to gumball my second geo metro i was not expecting to own two of them um i bought this off my friend for a hundred bucks it did run and drive and actually the original skit this was supposed to run and drive too but uh Some, uh, some abuse later. Yeah, it's, uh, I've abused this car and, uh, it don't, it don't run and drive anymore. I broke the CV axle on it. But for this one, uh, it's got an immaculate interior. Look at the carpet on this one. The seats are really nice. It doesn't smell like wet dog in here. And this one has not that many more miles than my other one. It is totally straight piped too. And, uh, yeah, she's kind of a hunk of junk, but the motor is getting pulled out of this motor interior. It also came with lowering springs, which are definitely going on Tic Tac for sure. 
Yeah, she, like I said, she has, some, she has a really nice interior in it. And under the hood, we have the same story. Um, 1.03 cylinder, pretty much identical, besides this one has a car battery and it's completely straight piped. considering that I broke the CV axle. So where am I going with this? Um, basically, the interior from Gumball is going into Tic Tac because the interior is mint condition in this car and this one's not. Um, the motor is going to get pulled out of Gumball, just as parts, you know, just in case I need a motor swap this one. Or who knows, maybe we'll get another Geo or something else we'll swap that into. You never know on the Florida Man Mason channel. So yeah, basically I just wanted to make this video to show the 175 of you that I'm not dead and that I'm still alive and I'm still doing projects. I also just wanted to say thank you guys for 175 subscribers. It means a whole lot to me. It really does. I know it's not that big of a milestone, but hell, I appreciate you guys. I really do. Each and every one of you that watch my shitty videos. So yeah, I really appreciate you guys, and you guys have some content coming up soon. So you have basically a restoration of Tic Tac, and Gumball's motor might get swapped into something. Hmm, maybe. Oh yeah, and I also own, I also own the OG Craftsman again, so... Yep, I need to uh, get that one going. My empire of three cars at this point, Jesus Christ, I need to get rid of the parts Mercedes and, the, and uh, Gumball. So yeah, um, stay tuned to the channel, guys. Tic Tac's going to become a really nice car, and Gumball's motor might be going into something else. Who knows? Like I said, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for 175 subscribers. And yeah, stay tuned.